how to show or hide arrowheads in your connector lines. Let's draw some connector lines. We can simply hover the mouse at the edge of the shape and then you can pull out the line. This is the default one that you will get after you launch the software. Let's connect one here and let's pull another one here, just like that. If your connectors are stick correctly, you can move those shapes and the line should actually follow. So that's the advantage of professional diagramming software like diagrams.net. All right, so if you click on the line itself, as you can see right now it's selected, I can adjust how thick the line is. I can adjust the color of the line. And of course we can adjust arrowheads. So the one on the left is known, but you can put arrow here as well. Take a look. And this one, by default, we already got arrow here, but we can change the style of it if you like. You can also put beginning or ending shapes as well. Keep in mind, we can switch them off, none and none, adjust the thickness, the color, and then set this up as the default. We can also change how the line will behave. So I will move it from sharp to rounded. So I've got these rounded edges of the line, that's nice. Now I will set this up as a default state for our connectors. So I click set as a default style. Then if I got a next shape to connect, when I hover my mouse, see the green color, pull up the line, take a look. It's exactly the same style as the previous one because we set up that style as the default one. We can also select all of the edges at once. Click Edit and then select Edges. This way you select all of the lines and you can customize the style now for all of them, same time. This way you can override whatever is there. Keep in mind you need to select again None. Be sure everything is overwrite nicely. And we are done. We modify the default arrows to be a dash connecting line without arrowheads. And you already know how to do it other way around. I hope this short tutorial was helpful. See you in the next one.